We've arrived at Oscar Schreier State Park Campground near Sarasota, Florida. Let's go check it out. As you pull into the state park, you just check in with the ranger off to the left there. Well, we're here at Oscar Schreier State Park, and uh, I want to show you the map they have here. We are right here at Lake Osprey. There's a nature center here, and um, Melody and I are going to walk around the lake. We're going to give you a, a little uh, walking tour of the day use area around Osprey. Lake Osprey, it's the, oh, I call it the center hub of the day use area here at Oscar Schreier State Park. And then we're going to, I'm going to take you on a walking tour of the campground. This is a very popular campground. Uh, Oscar Schreier State Park is uh, near Sarasota and um, Nokomis and Venice Beaches. So, very popular state park. Let me show you around. Okay, so this is Osprey Lake, but before we go around the lake, there's, a, there's restrooms right there. And then we have a, a playground for the kids. And there's a picnic area here. Parking is, uh, you can see my truck just past that pine tree there. And, uh, there's a nature center over in there. We're gonna go take a look at it. But uh, here's Osprey Lake. We're going to uh, take a little walk around the lake and show you around. So they have a swimming beach here at Lake Osprey. No lifeguard on duty. They have a pavilion right here by the swimming beach. And they have these little cutouts where you can uh, take take in Lake Osprey. They have multiple seating areas that skirt the perimeter of the lake. There's all kinds of hiking trails that go through the park. And it is quite scenic. And here's an another vantage point of the lake and the swimming beach is taken from the perimeter trail. And they even have some picnic tables over here on the far side of the lake as you skirt the perimeter trail. And the sign there says that the state the lake is stocked. Well the water sure is clear. Beautiful day today. The campground is off to your left there. And then there's a walking bridge that takes you over to the campground. So this is what that's where we're going now. Boy, this is beautiful. Wow, how cool is this? All right, so we're, you can see an RV dead ahead there. So I'm gonna go over and give you a walking tour of the Oscar Schreier State Park Campground. So I'm in the campground. Uh, they do have another playground over here in the campground. There's the first set of restrooms I've come upon. You have uh, restaurants with flush toilets, showers in there. So this is the campground, this is the camping area, and I usually only show you preferred campsites. These are campsites that I would want to come back and camp in. So let's go check out the campground. I'll show you some from I'll show you the best campsites. So if you're coming into the campground, you're going to be heading, uh, you're going to be coming from the direction where the camera is facing right now. So the direction of travel is actually, you're heading that way. And the first site I've come upon, this is not a preferable site, but it is vacant. This is an extremely popular campground. Not many of these sites are uh, vacant. Uh, I wanted to check out the electric utilities. It'd be hard to get uh, 
you'd have to work a little to get your egg level in the site. And you got these roots sticking up. And, uh, oh, cool. 30, 50 amp electric hookup. Fairly new looking box. Uh, you got a good bit of room back in here. There's your fire pit and uh, picnic table. I do not see a soar and I do not see a water hookup. So, you'll have to tank up. And be prepared to dump your tanks when you leave. So let's continue down here and uh, we'll check out some preferable campsites. For those of you that like that campsite, uh, if you have a smaller camping configuration and you think that'll uh, meet your needs, that's site number 25. That site number 26 still would not be a preferable uh, campsite for me. Uh, it's, uh, it's a bit narrow. The folks uh, probably just pulled out because there's a fire still going there. You do have a dump station as you exit the campground. And right past the dump station, they have a walking trail that takes you to a campfire circle. Here are a second set of restrooms at Oscar Schreier State Park. Site number 44 is a nice looking site and it looks like it has a concrete pad with a picnic table back there. Site number 44 going down in the book for Oscar Schreier State Park Campground. It's going to be a 30, 50 amp electric service. No sore, no water. They do have an overflow parking area in the campground. I haven't been showing you a lot of these sites. Um, some aren't level. Some would be pretty tight for a big rig. This is uh, your typical site, site 53. Let me walk you back in this one since it's vacant. If you had a fifth wheel, it'd be pretty tight to get both your tow vehicle and a fifth wheel in here. Um, this one is only 30 amp, so you're going to have to check when you make a reservation what kind of electric service you have. But uh, there's your campfire ring picnic table, and uh, that's a look out from the rear of the site. Um, I could get my rig in here, but again, it'd be pretty tight, so it's not a preferable site for me. And to give you an idea of what I'm talking about, here's a travel trailer, and you can see how the truck's parked in there. That's site number 55. Okay, this is what I'm talking about. Site number 99 going down the book for Oscar Schreier State Park Campground. That's a pull-through site. Looks like they have a 50 amp connection hooked up. Um, don't know whether they got a, a T-bone or not. Um, so again, check the uh, electric service when you make a reservation. Site 99 going down the book. Site number 100, also a nice pull-through site. I'm glad I uh, made a full walking tour of the campground. I'd have missed these. Uh, site 100 going down the book. That's a keeper. Site 101, also a keeper. Not all the pull-through sites are created alike. Uh, last couple sites I passed to include this one have a little grade to them. Site 66 is going to be a keeper. Uh, it's a deep site. There's no overhead clearance issues. You can get a fifth wheel back in there with uh, plenty of room to put your tow vehicle or a large uh, Class A. And uh, the, the folks here have plenty of room uh, in the rear. They could have went back further if they wanted to. Site 66 going down the boat. This is another look of Site 99 from the other end. Nice looking site, Site 99. The outer perimeter on this loop says no pets. So be aware when you make your reservations whether the site will accommodate pets or not. 
a lot of folks in this campground have nimble camping configurations, small travel trailers, uh, medium-sized travel trailers, uh, class C's, small class C's, you have van here, um, not showing you a lot of these campsites. Yeah, if you have a, a more nimble camping configuration, the video tour may not be as important for you because you can get into so many different places. You can see that that site's got a, quite a, a pitch to it there. And uh, all these ones on the outer loop have been no pet and they are quite small. It gives you an idea what you're looking at. Okay, so that's a look back at the playground and there's the shower house again. And uh, here's another couple shot sites that illustrate, you know, the small um, quarters you have to work with. You got a van camping in this one, that's site 15. And uh, there's site 16 right there. Well, I'm glad we found a few preferable sites here at the Oscar Schreier State Park Campground. I think I'm going to leave it here. I'll have the upload and download speeds for Verizon, AT&T, and T-Mobile in the written video description on YouTube. If you like these videos, like and subscribe, and I'll see you down the road.